Excuse you. That was a cough, dude. Still, excuse you. Oh, I like accidentally tapped the space bar that resulted in that little glyph being displayed down there. Ah. They, and it results in a little, couple little triangular shaped glyphs being displayed in the um, mini map. And like nav points. They're completely player, player so, determined. So they're clairvoyants. Yeah, but you can always do it. Yeah. Your flash being dragged. Shut the fuck up, hybrids. Well, no, no clairvoyance just it creates a mist cloud that leads toward your objective. Skyrim reference. The most use, probably the most useless fucking spell in the entire Elder Scrolls series. Reminds reminds me of something from the dude. That guy's got a huge ass. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, my name is Hugh Janus. <laughs> Hugh Jass. Hugh Jass. That's a little more force than Hugh Janus. J A S S? Hugh Jass? <laughs> or loose ass. <laughs> is that a loose ass here? Yeah, I'm yours. Ribald names, yay. Oh, I love prank call names. <laughs> Ivana Tinkle. Ivana suck your dick. We are go go with a Chinese one. We Fukum Yong. Oh God, that is <laughs> racist. <laughs> <laughs> where's, that, where's that little kid when you need him? The little the little boy. That's racist. You'll probably see him in editing. <laughs> Your flesh will welcome us. Somehow, I don't think so. Ow! Uh, your, flesh, your flesh will welcome us. I hate to tell you guys, but no means no. <laughs> Apparently, the many don't understand that. Uh, I'm trying to come oh, up with more, pr I'm trying to come up with more prank call names. Uh, See more butts. Anything with butts? Butts, Johnson, or Bone. <laughs> Peter Ivan Staker. P.I. Staker. Or Piss Taker. <laughs> Never mind to use Peter there. <laughs> Welcome and that to one... System Shock 2LB! Now, now endure us making a whole bunch of bad puns. Oh, yes. Welcome to LPs. <laughs> We're going to hack that open. Well, hey, not bad. silly, unprofessional LPs by two jackasses who need to relax after a hard week of educationing. Alright, Buffy. Shut up. I don't even watch Buffy, so... I'm shocked. <laughs> Why are you... Considering it airs on Logo. <laughs> I don't watch... Is joke! It's joke I don't get, so I don't laugh. Logo's a TV network. I know, I know Logo's a TV network. It's named LGBT people. Oh, oh. Well, at least it used to be. Oh. It used to be aimed at gay, specifically. Right. Now it's... Uh, now it's more kind of generalist, which is bullshit. I thought there were a freaking... Did I... Did I forget something? Yes, I did. And lovely, another... Mother. God damn. Pissing. Let it all out. Let it all out. Yeah, I'll let it all out by. I'll let it all out by using bullets! <laughs> I've yet to make Torek a good outsmart. I think it outsmarted. There no, it goes. No, that was my bad. Not the that was you shooting the box instead of. Ow! Face me like a man! Doink. Doink. That little tiny wrench should not be hurting this big ass droid. Death of a thousand cuts. What? Death of a thousand cuts. Y yeah, pretty much. That or Frying Pan of Doom. No, you're thinking more of Princess Peach there. Uh, what game? She. Smash. She's oh. really fond of using a, a 
frying pan. Uh, well, I was I, thinking more of the trope specifically. I remember there was one time I tweeted uh, a Princess Peach role player on Twitter in universe offering her an automatic shotgun. For one, a frying pan just isn't enough, my lady. <laughs> You'll need it next time Bowser shows up for a visit. And I proceeded to offer in universe offer a, a Zelda role player an LMG. <laughs> Master Sword, what's that? <laughs> oh, hey, I didn't research that hybrid organ. I must expect them to research somewhere down the road. Remember, no, not, not warmed up. So if you're gonna funny. give a, if you're gonna give a gun to all the classic uh, game Zelda, characters, Zelda and Peach are the only ones I gave them to. Mm. Now I'm trying to think of what guns would be most fitting for different game characters. Railgun for Sonic, obviously. Why? Really fast projectile. Gotta go fast! Gotta go fast! Faster, 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 faster! Sonic X. Can he not hit me? You stunlocked the bastard. With... A tiny ass wrench. That's adding insult to injury. What was the shot? It's like you've you've n just just about doinked him to death with a wrench, and it's like I'm just gonna finish you off with a shotgun. It's not even you're not even you're not even worth putting in all the effort to kill you with a wrench. Sides up! Problems? I'm trying to repair this laser pistol. No. Oh. I have repair. Oh my damn. What? My my strength augmentation ran out. Oh. Oh, I can I can just juice it right back up. Oh, okay. No problem. Thank God I've got portable batteries for that purpose. Am I right? Yay for Duracell. Yep. Oh, and down the road I picked up something called a French Epstein device. What that is? It's a free weapon mod. Ooh. There there aren't there are enough of them in there to kind of negate hot <coughs> the need for high. Amounts of weapon skill, but, mm -hmm. but pistols mod level one. I don't want to modify that further. The laser pistol. Let's charge that up and put the French Epstein device to work. It's so how does okay? The laser pistol takes its own ammo, or is it regenerating? It it basically has an am ammo pool, and I didn't spec in the energy weapons. No, you didn't. I need five more modules for that. So I need to get out of here and head over to Cargo Bay 1. Alito, can you lend us a fiver? We I'm might... uploading you some more cyber modules. Use them carefully. They're hard to come by. Shut up, Polito. Ding! <laughs> you don't have to do the ding. I have a ding. That's just what you think. What? I feel no need to explain myself. As I'm getting hurt by a fucking protocol droid! <laughs> Those things fucking hate you, dude. Yep. <laughs> what did I ever do to you? Besides you kill your our bro brothers. Ex I was about to say, you, you mean besides killing their brethren? That's only because their brethren were trying to kill me first. <laughs> he to, started it! He started it! To a griefing sibling, that doesn't matter. Yeah, I'll just ask Tector. Hold on. Borderlands reference! Take a shot. Take a shot. <laughs> <laughs> Not that I, kind I, I of shot. I particularly like your your uh, deliver, delivery of it. Take a drink! <laughs> Please make your selection. Yes, I can, but shut up, vending machine. Thank you for choosing. Thank, 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 thank you for choosing value rep. Thank you, Bioshock, for only making them talk once. 
Except for the fact that the ammo vendor is incredibly racist. Uh, I've been running around all this time for no reason. What? What, what's been, Apparently what's, I've already got the engine the storage code for the Fluidix computer, which is just just through here. Well, have you do you have you produced a net gain in equipment and other things? Yeah. Then it wasn't for nothing. You have probably what it said? Huh? Hang on. One five oh six one. My bad. What the fuck? Hang on. Five oh six. One. Ah, shit. There we go. Entering numbers. A little tricky. Xerxes is one step ahead of Shut us. Shut up, Polito. He's performed an override this was actually important. control computer and blocked us out. But keep an eye open. You might be able to find some workaround. So can we have some psi modules? Nope, and there's and there's cyber modules, not cyber modules. Oh. And there was a there was a log there was a log left by Delacroix, which is uh, story important after I kill the cyber guy. Okay, let's have it. Somebody's been tampering with the Xerxes unit. In the interest of keeping secrets from the powers that be, I've installed a backdoor to the Fluidix control computer. To activate it, install hardware override 45M DEX in the system's monitoring unit in command control. You can find 45M DEX in auxiliary storage 5 in the coolant tubes. Key code 34760. What Delacroix just said basically GIMP is a oh just go find an override an override chip somewhere in the in the uh, fluidix control tubes, which are this is these areas again where we started out. She sounded like Dr. Tenenbaum at first, except she's French. She's and Dr. French instead of German. Right. 